Wednesday, the 19th of January, 2022. Here's what it was looking like this morning. We picked up that inch of lake effect overnight. And mid-morning, we got a short blast of snow. You'll see here in the radar clip where it came from. And as I said, it wasn't very long-lived. Could have snowed like this all day. We would have picked up easy half a foot or more. And here's what it was looking like out right front of the motel. I sent the camera out today with Adam and Paul. He was on the pipeline. And I'll tell you what, the other day when I went out last Thursday, pipeline definitely did not look like this. That snow we got on Monday did wonders for the trails. They were able to fill in all the imperfections, get it all groomed down nice like a countertop. And the boys went over to Pine Tree for lunch. And then they headed back our way. Long range forecast, limited snow in it, but that could always change. Temperatures wise, we're in good shape. Temperature's gonna hold what we have in place, that's for sure. Got a lot of nights below zero. And how can you be having a bad day riding conditions like this? Doesn't get much better. Report from the town, fair to good conditions, up to a five inch base. And then here's time lapse up at Stillwater, and you'll see around 10 o'clock, there we go, got the short blast of lake effect, or whatever it was, storm front. And then information center, we got a time lapse, and that's about it. You see overnight, it was quite cold. You know, it was below zero. And this morning when I got up, I came out and I looked at the thermometer, and I was like, oh, it's 20 below. And I'm looking a little bit closer, I said, no, it's 20 above. So it warmed up overnight. There was a short blast of snow. Sun peaked out a little bit. And as I said, long range forecast, we're going to stay nice and cold. Well, hope you have some plans to get some riding in because we definitely got the conditions. Hope you're having a good one. And remember, see ya.